Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I want to talk to you how Rockstar lied to us about removing content inside the Valentine's Day DLC update in 2016. So hopefully you guys will enjoy, make sure you guys drop a like if you enjoyed these kind of videos, subscribe down below if you haven't already, and let me know in the comments down below after watching this video, what do you think about this whole situation? Do you think Rockstar, what they did was right, or do you think it's wrong and should they change it back to what it was? But with that said, let's go and hop right on in. So as most of you guys know, Rockstar released a Valentine's Day update for 2016 just a couple of days ago for Grand Theft Auto V Online. Now, people were playing with it and they were very excited because the content said by Rockstar on their official Newswire post was to stay there forever and all the content will be here until the end of Grand Theft Auto V Online. It will be here forever. Now, a few players noticed that Rockstar started removing items so they were not purchasable. So these people were usually saving up, let's say they were saving up for the new Roosevelt or maybe the old one because it did come back anyways for you to buy, they were saving up for it and one day when they came on, it just wasn't there. So Rockstar is removing items. Now Rockstar never said anything about this yet, but people are saying that they're just removing items and they're not being able to be purchased anymore. So what I want you guys to do is go inside Grand Theft Auto Online and just go to the Legendary Motorsports website and let me know in the comments down below, do the Roosevelt's, both of them, still show up for you or are they gone off the store? For me, they were there, but for my friend, they weren't. So this is kind of weird. I'm not sure what is going on. I'm pretty sure it's a glitch because again, they did state on their newswire that they're going to be there forever and if they stated on there, Unless if they're going to change it, which they're probably going to make like an, a little edit post on the bottom of that or even on the top probably to let people know. They didn't do that, so this is most likely a glitch. So if I were you, I would s still save your money and don't get your hopes down if you don't see it. Now, if you don't see it for like a few days, if you keep on trying switching sessions and that kind of stuff, I highly recommend you contact Rockstar Support and they should be able to help you out. And I'm pretty sure they're well aware of this glitch because a lot of people are experiencing it and reporting it. But if you are experiencing it, again, make sure you report it to them because the more people we get to report it, the higher I'll get in their search system and the faster they will get this problem solved so you guys can purchase your cars asap so there you go that is probably going to wrap it up make sure you guys stay safe out there because rockstar is doing a lot of crazy stuff inside the game and there are a whole bunch of glitches going around that are really making the experience a lot worse now, as I said in my previous video, there was also another glitch that was going around where the customization of your car just was not sticking and I basically customized the car for, like, for millions of dollars inside the game and then I put it into my garage and it was just uncustomized and I was not able to keep it because I wasted all my money and the customization was just gone. It was just a regular car after that even though they took my money. So yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff like this going on where pe people are either a losing stuff or stuff is just changing around. So yeah, make sure you stay safe out there. So as I said before, make sure you guys drop a like if you enjoy these kind of videos. Stay subscribed to the channel for more videos just like this. I upload daily Grand Theft Auto 5 content that you guys definitely do not want to miss out on. And again, let me know in the comments down below. Make sure you go inside your game and check for me. Are your vehicles, clothing options, and all that stuff, is it there for you or did they dis disappear for you? Let me know in the comments down below. I want to hear what you guys think. Anyways, my name is Jeff. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next one.